eye infections. Eye infections are common in babies. This video will show how to identify and manage eye infections in the young baby. First, take a history. These parents have brought their five-day-old baby to the clinic. They are concerned his eyes are crusty. He is otherwise healthy and feeding well. Ask these important questions. When did the eye problem start? Was the baby given preventative eye treatment at birth? Did the mother have a vaginal discharge during her pregnancy? The mother reports that the baby has had crusty eyes for two days. The baby was born at home and no medicine has been put in the baby's eyes. The mother did not have vaginal symptoms in her pregnancy. Wash your hands and wear gloves to reduce the risk of spreading the eye infection to other babies. Next, examine the baby's eyes. When babies fuss and cry, it's hard to do a good eye exam. Try wrapping the baby. Then position her on the mother's lap, facing you. First, observe. We see sticky discharge and crusting at the eyelid margins, but no swelling of the eyelids and no yellow pus draining from the eyes. Gently open the eyes. We see redness in the inner eyelids. Now, determine if the baby has a mild, moderate, or severe eye infection. Let's compare. Here is a baby with normal eyes compared to a baby with a mild eye infection. In the mild eye infection, there is some mucoid discharge, but the eyes are not swollen or red. Now, compare the mild eye infection to the baby with a moderate eye infection. There is more discharge and the inner eyelids are very red. In a severe eye infection, the key finding is swelling of the eyelids. There is also obvious pus. Managing a mild eye infection. A mild eye infection only needs the eyes to be cleaned. The mother should wash her hands before and after cleaning her baby's eyes. She wets a clean cloth with water that has been boiled and cooled. She wipes the baby's eyes from inside to outside with a clean corner until the discharge is gone. Advise that she clean the baby's eyes four times a day until the eyes are clear. Ask her to return if the baby's eyes are not better in four days. Washing the cloths with soap and water and drying them in the sun between uses will prevent the infection from spreading to others. Managing a moderate eye infection or a mild eye infection that has not improved. This baby's eyes have not improved after four days. So she should not be treated with erythromycin by mouth and antibiotic eye ointment. The medicines are given four times a day for 14 days. To apply eye ointment, gently open the baby's eyelids and run a line of the ointment across each eye from inside to outside. Yeah. 
managing a severe eye infection. In a severe infection, the young baby will have very red eyes, swelling, and thick yellow pus draining from one or both eyes. Swelling of the eyelids can make it difficult to open the eyes and difficult for the pus to escape. These signs appear in the first month, often due to sexually transmitted infections such as gonorrhea or chlamydia that are passed from mother to baby during birth. It's best to prevent these infections by screening and treating pregnant women for sexually transmitted infections. Eye medicine put in the baby's eyes within an hour of birth is also a good preventative measure. In severe eye infections, the eye fills with pus as if it were an abscess. This can cause softening and rupture of the cornea resulting quickly in blindness. Give a single dose of ceftriaxone and refer these babies urgently. Every effort should be made to refer these babies, but if referral is not possible, do your best to care for the baby in your clinic, though realize that this care is not the same. Give a single dose of ceftriaxone plus 14 days of erythromycin by mouth and antibiotic eye ointment per your national protocol. Clean the eyes frequently until the pus stops forming. Remember, a mild eye infection is cared for by cleaning the eyes. If the infection is moderate or the mild infection persists after four days, treat with an antibiotic by mouth and eye ointment. A baby with a serious eye infection has swollen eyelids and thick pus drainage. Give ceftriaxone and refer urgently.